Hi everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. So, last time out, we were trying to find a way... Well, first of all, we got into an argument with... David Madsen, and then we left Chloe's house, and we're trying to get Frank's keys. The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Why would it? That would be weird. Uh, saved dogs. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides... You don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. <coughs> Yoink. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! Do I have to keep? Do I, ha I have to keep going? But I still have the keys. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. And he has no idea where I was even here. Are you shitting me? Oh, come on. Alyssa, watch out. Quit thinking, Max. Yeah, that's all right. How you doing? Whew. That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. I saw you try and save my friend Gate on that roof. The only one who did. While people took camera pics. Um... I tried. Yep, I tried. And Kate died. Knock that shit off. The whole school saw you trying to talk her down. But nobody could have. You're still a hero, Max. That's not how I feel today, but thanks. We need to hang out more. Drink some wine. I have to go, but let's talk later, cool? Okay. Oops, wrong button. It's the other one that makes you run faster. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Throw in the parking lot. Get the treat, treat boy. I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace, but let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. I wasn't going to throw the bone into the road, especially because I thought I just had a Damn. truck go past. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. 
I know. Just daydreaming. Well, let's see what we can find out. You scope the area while I... The archetypal filthy guy dishes. It's not what I was trying to look at, but... Frank? I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. No prize here. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. Presto, Chloe's gun. Should I give it back to her? Um, I think it's better not for Frank not to have it. I have a terrible present for you. Ugh, an ounce of dank bud? Oh, you so rule, Max. Thank you. I feel so much better now. You better bring it back to David right away. Yeah, sure. I'm on it. I'm not sure that was a good idea, but it's done now. I might regret this, but I can't let Frank hurt someone. Yeah, that was my feeling. It's better to get it away from Frank. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Yeah, it is. Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? Crappy wife Too bad here. I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Is Frank going to deal online now? Maybe. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. I haven't seen any tools yet. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Ooh, what's in this cupboard? Ooh, Frank's stash. Is there another cupboard I can open? Ah. No more secrets. So what can I pry it open with? Am I prying it open this with a knife? This is almost as good as a set of keys. If you say so. My blade will open any portal. That's what we're after. Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you. There's a lot of weird shit going on in my life, and sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. You're one of the best things I have here, and I smile when I think of us together. Mm -hmm. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. That was not cool what you did, and don't blame the drugs, you actually scared me and I thought you'd... What does that say? Never chill out. I've never seen you act that way, and the next time you will be the last... Hmm... Can I rewind so it closes? Smart. Mm -hmm. 
And it makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Oh, he ain't getting back in his RV anytime soon. And that was some seriously reckless driving. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's nobody's fault. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah blah blah, as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh killed herself. She's dead. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel better about my fucked up life, get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? William? Hmm? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Mm, I can tell. I can tell. But look at everything that's happened the past week. Your life has changed mine, and that's not shit. I'd really love to believe that. I'd like to believe in something after what's happened. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me, and Rachel needs you. Where are we going now? I didn't expect another load screen so quickly. She's not in a good mood. Oh my god. What is happening now? What is happening now?
How is that not in focus? Come on now. Oh, seriously? How much more in focus do you want it? I don't know what I did differently that that last time, but I swear it was that in focus every other time I made it in focus, but anyway. Someday Dad'll get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well... I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Hint, Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that we'll far back in breaks. time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them crepes. I'm 18 years and old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat How? We. I volunteer to break the eggs. This you is weird. How many eggs? Mom said it depends. Chloe That's is just true. so damn happy and Don't carefree. Question the chef. And this is the last like time unless I change here. it. I love I, William like he was in my own family. I'll let her know I won't let right him right die today. I won't. What are we going to have to do about it then? I know I've seen those pictures before. Man, I remember Chloe reading this, but not after today. I got it. Oh, I'm not allowed to get it. Okay. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Um, I don't know. Where are your keys? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Well, let's go back and we'll hide his keys. Mom said it depends. That's score. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here. I am when your mom is away. Throw keys out the window. I'll let her know that. This is the best place for them. Can't find them if they're not in the house. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and Joyce and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. 
We are awesome. So this made a big change. I remember like big chunks of story, but not a little. I like I don't remember this little sequence. I don't remember what happens next, and I want to know. You are such a cowboy. I knew you'd pick up with that music. I'm not paying one hundred fifty dollars for a concert. I've heard that the Vortex Club parties are wild. Dude, the service fee is like fifty percent. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. cold every day. But Never, Maxine. I know. Sorry, Mad Max. You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. Warren. He hooked up with Stella? Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Like everything, I would imagine. Chloe. Well, I'm not worried about that change.
going to say anything, because I'm sure the story will tell us. Um, so, we stole the money, because it seemed like the right thing to do, I think. Uh, we kissed Chloe, because, I mean, how could you not? Who are the 18% of people that sided with David? Uh, we kept Frank dog, Frank's dog from harm. Oh, 71% of people gave Chloe the gun back. So I don't feel so bad about that now. Lisa is dead. Who's Lisa? Is Lisa the bunny? Did I overfeed the bunny? Well, I don't know about that one. Um, you didn't help Warren with it? I didn't know I could help Warren with his exam. Oh well. Apparently 65% of other people didn't either, so... You are on the Vortex Club party list. Only 9% of people did that. But I kind of did that because I played the game before, so I kind of knew it could be helpful. Um, I didn't change the Vortex Club party list. No, I didn't erase stuff, I just added myself to it. Uh, didn't erase the cop's message. I didn't know I could. Um, I helped Alyssa. Didn't warn the homeless woman. Again, I didn't even know that was a thing. Didn't take a photo in the past. You didn't leave a mark on the fireplace. Again, I didn't know I could do those things. Well, that is where we're going to end this episode and next time out we will start on chapter 4 if you enjoyed this one hit the like button below or let me know what you thought in the comments and join us next time for the next one